thank you very much for this uh, surprise and uh, last speech of the day and my first one as EDA president. So uh, when uh, Jose went to the board of director uh, presenting this location for the a lot for the formal dinner, I were a little bit concerned. So I, I basically asked to the board of directors, say, guys, I step back. Because we are in one of the most beautiful cities in the world, in one of the most famous locations in the world. I really don't want that someone misunderstood that this evening is in some way the projection of my ego in some way. <laughs> so, <laughs> finally, the board of directors decided to be here and I'm, I thank them because there is no better location for the evening. So thank you very much, my friend. Thanks, Paco. You stretch your presidency for one more year to avoid me to become the first ever virtual president of the EDA. <laughs> so thank you very much. And despite Beatrice have already said a beautiful word, I have to thank also uh, my family. I know it, it's very Italian, but it is what it is. <laughs> I'm standing here today because for me, demolition is very important part of my life. My brother Roberto and myself, we've been attending EDA conferences since we were just kids. My first conference in 1998, I was 11 and Roberto was eight years old. So uh, thanks for the passion we saw for the industry in our father, uh, Giuseppe. Both of us decided to stay in the business and continue the work for Despe. So now, Roberto, Giuseppe, uh, you have to know that in the next three years, you, you will work hard because I, I will have to, to invest some of my time in, you know, in public relations. So my apologies in advance, but... <laughs> Don't worry, double salary for me. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks uh, also to my mother, Gabriella, also here today, who has come to many EDA conventions and events in the last 30 years. And uh, most important, he grew my brothers and me up while Giuseppe was struck, struggling to set up a demolition company that is not easy. Thank you to my wife, Elisa, for her love and support. And thanks to my three beautiful <laughs> daughters. Uh, I, I'm really proud how you are growing up despite you have a part-time dad because I, you are sharing you know, your dad with uh, his business. So thank you very much because you are growing very well. Now, just finish, just one minute. Becoming president of the ETA is a great honor and responsibility for me. I love our industry what we do, and how we continue to evolve in our work. And over the years, I understood that behind our work, there is another important part of the industry, our community. And I read community, and I think friendship. So I have to thank all the board of directors to support me in the last years. I have to thank the Italian team that joined Paris for this event and all the friends coming from all Europe. And I'm sure I'm forgetting someone else, someone, and please forgive me, but uh, thanks to, to Mark, uh, fra thanks to Brian from Canada, thanks to uh, Peter and Christian, thanks to, thanks to Chelsea from Spain. So I, 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 I'm seeing a lot of friends and that makes me happy. Thank you very much. <laughs> Finally, I would like to uh, special thanks to the um, Sinclair family. 
I know that tonight William is here also in behalf of his father, David, that did a flight from United States to be here. Unluckily for passport travel, it was not possible to attend the dinner, but I really appreciate the nearness of your family to, to, to this moment. Uh, to, uh, uh, thank you, thank you very much. Uh, from today, I'm proud that uh, there is another thing in common, that we will be the second father, the son and father presidency. And this happened only two times in the ADA history. So I'm really proud to be near you and David and Giuseppe in this special event. Thank you very much. The National Association and the international community are very important to develop and shape the future of our industry. So, with the help and support from you and our colleagues of EDA Board of Directors, I will do my best to serve you as EDA President. Thank you very much. I am honored to name my colleague Patrick Fry as the EDA Vice President. And finally, to close the night at the EDA Gala Dinner 2022, I have the honor to name our friend, my friend and colleague, Francisco Cobo, member of the EDA Club of Honor. Thank you, Paco, for your service and for all the years you have dedicated to the industry. Wow.